Hello guys, this is Benjamin94 with another Let's Play. And guys, you're probably wondering why I am standing out in a new world you haven't seen before. And yeah, 1.3 reason hasn't come out yet, but that's why I'm yeah. I was invited on a server, you know. <laughs> and this server is with my best friends, so oops. It's going to be a lot of fun. And first I'll show you our little community here, uh, our spawn village. And yeah, you probably know some of the guys because I've been in contact with them. And yeah, this is a venue server called I don't know what we're going to call it, but right now it's called the uh, yeah, Pulic Craft. But in English translation, translation it's translated into Sausage Craft. Kind of. Yeah, I don't, I don't know why we call it that, but. But yeah, first of all, uh, let's check out the, uh, the spawn area here. And uh, here are some community farms that. The Danish guy built, you probably heard of him, I've mentioned him quite some times in my old let's play. And yeah, it's just, just community farms and some animal bands. Yeah, you can spell out the name. Um, and here is, yeah, he lives in town, anyway, the, Danish, the Danish guy, been 12, sorry. Um, and yeah, it's just, he has moved out to a new area. Oh, there's something wrong here. Yeah, and we went a bit crazy. We played till like five yesterday, and it was very late. Just strip mine. Yeah, we went all out crazy with stuff. <laughs> um. Yeah, and this is. Uh, yeah. Party on. This is the access place. He has a very beautiful house. I ought to say, oh, sorry, my sound is high. He has a very beautiful place. I really like this design with the birch wood. Oh, someone just joined. Um, that's uh, business. No, oh, stupid rain. Hello. And this is a uh, community. What? What? Oh well, <laughs> this is uh, the community in Chenigrom that the Danish guy built. It's decent, very nice. Not not the most epic um, system because yeah, it, it uh, yeah you need torches to stop at high level. Like you you don't have all this piston redstone stuff, which he likes to do actually. Oh, just a at the moment. I hope he understands. He isn't that much into micro videos, I think. And this is his house. It's just a uh, very nice design with locks and yeah, glass and so on. Oh, this, this is crazy. Oh, just, what is, what is this? I haven't seen this before, it's just, what's in here? What's this? I haven't seen this before. Oh, yeah. Don't know. Don't really. Yeah. It's really. Guys in the server, they're crazy. They just went all out crazy in this spawn area. <laughs> As you can see. And yeah, this is my establishment. I'm going to change the sign because I don't know why I wrote the resistance. I don't know if that. Real, but I'm going to rename it right now actually. What are we going to call it? We are going to call it the house of like so. That's very nice. We oh, went for some fishing, I think. No, it's, yeah, he's just destroying the landscape. Oh god, we moved. Well, nice, we moved. Not too bad. Yeah, and this is my house, it's just a little sand garden here, no big deal, and yeah, I actually got inspired by um, 
Karelis for this house because he's a very nice builder and a bit Exuma with the um, house slab and oh down here actually this is inspired by Exuma uh, the uh, sandstone uh, with the double slab stone block yeah, and this is just a little refine no big deal so yeah this is our spawn and well that's a big cobblestone pillar I must be the Danish guy who made that. <laughs> um, yeah, and that way there's a sand quarry and some nice caves. I want to know what what he's doing. Oh, it may be a a little boat dog or something. I don't know, but yeah. Also, here are, is our nether portal. We're going to make some nice housing for it and something like that. But uh, for now it's just okay. And yeah, I want to talk about something when we arrive at my new base. Um, and I'll skip this part with the nether because yeah, I want to talk about that. So yeah, guys, now we arrived at my nether portal, and yeah, I spawned right out in this ocean. But I saw this majestic mountain. It seems that I my settings are oh well, it's pretty normal just I don't know but uh, yeah the thing I want to talk about about the Nether is that uh, we haven't we are not that good at starting servers and such but we managed to do it buying a server and it's dedicated and whitelisted so that's pretty nice. Uh, but also, we haven't accumulated much RAM into the nether, so, and there was also talk about uh, on the server properties, um, so the nether likes like crazy. Every time you have to render a new chunk, it takes you down to like one frame per second, and that's really, really not cool, so you get like this cool uh, yeah, my French thing isn't that good when recording, but from uh, 30 frames per second to like 1 frame per second, frame per second, frames. so that's a problem. And we are going to work on a nether hub down in the nether with the train station and so on and so forth. Um, yeah, and this is my base. It isn't nearly complete. Oops. Yep. <laughs> I just fell down. Uh, I'm going to polish this up the outside as outside because yeah, it's super ugly. But this uh, right here is going to be my nether room. And as you can see it's going to go all the way down there. And I really enjoyed digging. I don't know why I enjoy it so much but I just wanna dig. <laughs> So, <laughs> yeah, I have some cool plans for this, but this is only going to be my uh, nether room with some stairs going down to, to there, down there, and that is going to be, there's going to be a hallway into there, which is going into the main hall of my uh, base, which actually was my original idea for uh, my new LP, but I think my new LP is going to be on the server here, so... Um, yeah, that's pretty decent. But if something happens, like the server dies or something, then I don't know what I'm going to do because I already spent a lot of time on this. But I enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, actually, um, my plans for this room is going to have going to be uh, like this wall is of course going to go and here. There's going to be a nether brick all the way down and some lava flowing down on the floor. I'm going to make it a nethery, if you understand, have lava lakes and soul sand and netherrack all scattered around and like with nice aesthetics and already collected all this stone just for digging. And yeah, and like my if you think this is a whole base it, it's not actually um this is like one percent of the base when i'm finished with this room it's going to be like 
This is the nether room, only for the purpose of nether traveling. Uh, then I'm going to have an enchanting room with enchantment and so on. If you have, if you watch Nebris, I'm thinking of having a base like his style, like very grand and having single functionalities for. Um, I should dig while I talk. Having uh, functionalities, one functionality like have a giant brewing room, even though I don't really brew or something. I just want. Like I built my house at the spawn. When I built on a server, I think that everything should be nice, everything should be perfect, and that is my goal with this. Let's play. Excellent. So yeah, guys, I don't know what we're going to talk about. I'm going to take this all out, and when you see episode two of this, hopefully, I am. Oh, my little brother is talking to um, I'm hopefully finished with this stuff. So, I'll see you guys there. Uh, this has been Benjamin94. I really hope you like this video and I hope you enjoy my new series on the sausage craft server. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, guys, I'll see you guys next time.